you never hear me talk about, oh, here's how great I am because I don't see myself that way because I always have somewhere I'm trying to grow and continue to get to. So if you don't feel you're where you need to be, then that's right where you need to be as far as perspective. Also, at the same time, take it easy on yourself. You know, you have the whole rest of your life to take your next step. Being able to talk to people who are having the same experiences, the same initiation, like initiations as in when you expand so much, eventually you're going to come across your own limitations. Like a place in a dream is represents your state of mind. So if you're inside in a room and you have four walls, if you're expanding, if you're expanding your consciousness, you're filling that space and you're getting bigger and bigger. So eventually you're going to come across all four walls. Walls represent limitations. So this is a good way to view it in your mind, to visualize it in your mind is as you begin to expand and you come across these personal limitations, like you know, self-doubt, maybe as you continue going along, it becomes more and more prevalent in the front of your mind because you've been digging deeper and deeper within yourself and unearthing it. And so then it becomes really hard to really go forward. You start doubting yourself and, 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 it's, and it's more intense than ever before, even though you're growing and doing things to go get further along. That, that's an initiation point, meaning you have to initiate more energy and effort to break through that wall. Once you do that, then on the other side of that, you have a lot more space to continue expanding and growing. And some, some people at those initiation points, they don't expand and they kind of contract a little. 